a Harrisburg artist is getting international attention. Some of her paintings will soon be decorating the U.S. Embassy mm. in Moldova. Our, our Sonic Abargo spoke to her about how all this happened. Bottles of paint. I love this paint. A rack of paint brushes. It allows you to layer. And a stack of canvases. It gives it more vibrancy to me. Filling Raina Wooden's Harrisburg studio. I always loved art as a child. I never saw myself doing it full time though. 20 years ago, Wooden, who goes by the artist name Raina76, didn't have a studio. She worked as a consultant. It wasn't working out for me. So she changed course, pursuing art full time. My family was nervous. They were unsure that if I could sustain myself. Now Raina has years of success behind her. They incorporate the crowns and the keystone symbol. And in January, things took an unexpected turn. She got an email from a federal program called Art in Embassies. I didn't believe it. I thought it was spam. I ignored it. But they reached out again, explaining they wanted her art on the walls of the U.S. Embassy in Moldova. I didn't even know that. Moldova was a country. It was geography 101 for me. The U.S. ambassador to Moldova, Kent Logsdon, is from Pennsylvania. He had seen Reyna's work and knew she was the right choice. He loved my Keystone series. The embassy is also bringing Reyna to Moldova for a few days to see her paintings go up. I hope I don't faint. No, <laughs> no but honestly, <laughs> I am just going to be pleased and humbled. She'll also get a chance to share advice with high school students studying art. It's like a dream come true. It's just an opportunity I never saw coming. In Harrisburg, Sonica Bargo. Almost finished, but not quite. ABC 27 News.